Parisian, and this is Dream of Parisian Tarot. We're gonna get a few cards from my Scorpios, okay? Please like this video if it resonates at all. Also, if you're new to my channel, please subscribe. And don't forget to check out my TikTok. The link is down below in the description box. And if you would like a personal reading, that information is also down below in the description box. So as soon as I open up the deck, the energy for my Scorpios is... We got a healer. So you could definitely be a natural healer. It says, passion to serve others by repairing the body, mind, and spirit. Ability to help transform pain into healing okay you also got the card that says guide so people could listen to you it says represents the nature of the divine in life and in yourself okay also a lot of times when this card comes out somebody's like into their spirituality a terror or a psychic of some sort all right also know if this is not happening directly to you it could be happening to your person or somebody around you so put it with every fix okay i could be saying he well, really, it could be a she. So flip it and reverse it how need be. So it's like some of y'all are seen as a bit of a rebel, okay? You do your own thing, okay? But it says, challenges authority to affect social change. Reject spiritual systems that do not serve inner needs. So somebody could be mad at your spirituality in some type of way, okay? You also got the card that says, female fatality. It says, highlights the erotic energy of the feminine. Opens your heart when your dependency is rejected. So you definitely are sexy, okay? People see you as sexy and a bit of a rebel. You also got the card that says, priest. It says, facilitate spiritual commitment. Serves as a channel of spiritual energy. All right, so you channel different frequencies straight from God, straight from spirit, okay? So you definitely could be into your spirituality here, okay? Let's get a few more cards for y'all. As soon as I open up the deck, the energy for my Scorpios is the Four of Swords. So some of y'all could be doing some deep healing at this time. Pamper yourself. Give yourself lots of self-love, okay? But somebody got a bone to pick with you, Scorpio. Because right under this, you got the Five of Wands, which is about competition, jealousy, and conflict. So somebody could be in competition with you and mad at you, all right, at this time. Let's get a few more cards for my Scorpios. All right, we got the ten of wands. So somebody feels burdened right now. Why are they feeling burdened? All right, family members. Family members could be feeling burdened, upset with you in some type of way. Let's see. Let's get a few more cards. What's going on here? All right, let's see. The Empress, Knight of Cups. So look, somebody's mad at you because your person sees you as the Empress right and they could definitely want to have a family with you and a baby with you because as you can see she's pregnant but they also mad because your person wants to come in and bring you some type of offer and express their true feelings to you so this could be his family members or it could be yours but somebody's like family could be mad that your person is in love with you they the ones they want to come in and bring you that communication and tell you how they feel somebody's trying to block this offer block this person from coming yeah also somebody wants to communicate something about your style the way you wear your clothes also they want to take some type of risk towards you somebody's heavily watching you on social media at this time watching everything that you do trying to be just like you okay the nine of cups they feel like you're getting all your wishes and your manifestations okay Yeah, the wheel, you got the wheel of fortune. You got good luck. You got good fortune. You got pure happiness coming to you. And this person wants a family with you. They feel like you wife wifey material. All right? And they feel like you got the bag. You got the money, too. Let's see. So this person feels like you're their everything, which explains why you're coming out as the empress. But somebody's mad at you. Okay? You got the seven of cups. Definitely some of you that could be focused on your health, wealth, and beauty. If not, you need to be. But this is good. This is really good energy for you, Scorpio. All right. So after someone broke your heart or put you, broke your heart or put you into some type of third-party situation, they want to come in and bring you some type of offer. Oh, you got two. Can uh oh, <laughs> Scorpio. All right. So you got a Knight of Pentacles. So somebody trying to get something together right now. They're strategizing and trying to get themselves stable and stuff to bring you some type of offer, right? Let's get up over here. Okay. So we got the King of Swords and the King of Pentacles. So you got more than one king looking at you trying to come in and bring you something. Let's see. All right. 
okay so seven of cups you being heavily watched by multiple people on social media scorpio somebody want to come in and apologize to you after something ended between you and someone so an ex is coming back okay page of wands they come in and bring you some type of good news also, somebody's definitely working work, working on their health. You got wishes about to come true. You finna have everything, right? Ten of Cups, pure happiness, ha family, everything. It's something about your work. Your work is finna bring you a lot of prosperity, a lot of money, stuff like that, okay? Somebody's heavily focused on your creative ideas and stuff. Whatever you create and do and posting, they stalking, they watching, all right? It's bringing you pure happiness, everything, period. Let's see. As soon as I open up the deck, we'll be seeing. Go slow. Take time to get to know each other, all right? You are protected, Scorpio. You are safe and divinely guided, most definitely. Always. Let's see. What this say? This is fate. This is a destined partnership, okay? So there's somebody that you're meant to be with, and they're definitely coming towards you. And they're longing for you. Someone is secretly yearning for you. And they're obsessed with you. Someone in this connection is gripped up by obsessive thoughts. But you could have your boundaries up with them. So there could definitely be trust issues. Um, firm boundaries are an oh okay. All right, so this is why we see multiple people. You remember how you had two kings over the well, actually, you had a knight and two kings. Okay, so it could definitely be like three or four people trying to come in and talk to you. That's probably why you had the seven of cups, too, which means options. But there are some people that you're putting your boundaries up with because you know they're on their bullshit trying to be strictly sexual. So definitely keep your boundaries up, okay with them people but there's somebody that you faded to be with you know what i'm saying obstacles unhealed wounds are blocking for moving so you could be trying to heal things with this person that you're faded to be with okay all right let's get a few more calls here yeah because you coming off sexy so you coming off alluring and sexy and shit so people want to come talk to you whatever you doing you getting attention yeah yeah because look the, hold on, those feelings you feel, I feel them too. So you got like this deep connection with your person because, of course, y'all fated to be together, right? But you also got the card that says, Everybody knows who you are. You made a name for yourself, but also a target on your back. So you being targeted here and they sniffing your energy, they sniffing your power. So protect yourself. That's why we seem protected. Protect yourself, okay? But you already protected over, you know. So, yeah, something happened in the past. It says it all stems from some shit that happened back in the day. All right? You also got the card that says my main concern is to work on my finances and create long-term stability. All right, my bad. But, yeah. It all stems from some shit that happened back in the day. So, something happened in the past that needs to be healed. And also, somebody is working on their stability and security. My main concern is to work on my finances and create long-term stability. Let's see. Cards for my Scorpios. Yeah, so they was talking to other people who was trying to be like you, act like you, and look like you. It says, I tried to replace you, but I can't find anybody like you, okay? You also got the card that says, I'm angry and emotionally disconnected from friends and family because I'm unhappy with my life. So they're unhappy with the things that's going on and stuff like that as well. But they want to marry you. <clears throat> I'm saving up money to buy you a ring because you're the one I want to marry. Let's get a few more calls from my Scorpios. It says, I admit I was selfish and I didn't think about your feelings. All right? So now they're starting to realize that. And they ex keeps coming between y'all because I just seen the card. But it says, I'm learning from you and seeing things from a higher perspective. You're making me grow as a person. Okay? So, they watching you. They learning from you. I showed y'all this one. You are so secretive and it's hard to read you. So, they trying to figure you out. They trying to understand you. Alright? And it says, I hope I'm not running out of time to fix this. And it says, I know other people are looking at you and it makes me a little jealous and possessive. So, they know multiple people could want you. At the bottom of the deck, it says, people are trying so hard to, from, 
hard to stop me from loving you, but fuck them. I'm going to love you anyway. All right. This card was sticking out. It says the karmic is trying to steal divine feminine spiritual gifts because she actually admires her. So somebody's trying to steal your um, personality, identity, whatever. Okay. They're trying to be like you in some type of way. Steal your style. Period. Okay. <clears throat> a few more cards for my Scorpio y'all please don't forget to hit that like button it really helps out my channel thank y'all so much for the support <clears throat> it says thinking about you gives me anxiety it says stop being so cold towards me so either they being cold towards you or you being cold towards them but they want more attention from you all right you could definitely have some very powerful magic people are sniffing that shit and attracted to that shit so be careful protect what's yours Sexy clothing and lingerie. That's why you had that female fatality. Okay? You also got the card that says, I love to show you out. So they feel like you're real sexy. And it says, people competing with your looks. What were we talking about? Are right, they trying to steal your shit? So be careful. <clears throat> Far from my Scorpios. All right. They can't get nothing past you because you're very intuitive. So very psychic. You will be having a whole bunch of joy and happiness. Okay? And it says, deep down, I'm really sensitive. I just put up a front. So somebody's hiding their feelings and emotions. And you got a nosy neighbor, okay? This could be your actual neighbor or somebody in your circle that's being nosy as fuck. But like somebody been trying to make you look bad. But it says everyone knows the truth about the lies they told on you, okay? So don't even worry about it. People know that you're the best person for the job. They know that you're the best person to do whatever the fuck you do, all right? But they being influenced by someone else. So people are trying to change people's minds or perception about you in some kind of way, trying to make you look bad. <clears throat> you could be learning new skills. Your person wants to tell you that they don't love them hoes, all right? And you finna get some type of sponsors and endorsements. You also got the card that says, I see now, which means things are being exposed. Things are being revealed. And it says, our deep convos mean the world to me. They love talking to you. And somebody feels stuck. They have to for the kids. So some type of obliga obligations or codependency in some type of way. But your person feels like they could never be you, okay? Let's get a few more cards. All right, as soon as I open up the deck, the energy for my Scorpios is feeling real guilty for what they did, okay? So somebody did some fucked up shit and I did feeling guilty. It says the karmic is trying to do everything that you're doing, okay? So they're trying to be just like you because you're going to be successful because I'm seeing working towards success. Keep going, all right? So keep doing what you're doing, Scorpio. Somebody was bullied in the past, but now they're the star. Copyright for <laughs> all they can't be you, Scorpio. War. Somebody can have a war for that rest. And it says, work consistently until the final test is complete. You finna reach some type of success or something. There is a deceased grandmother worried about their grandchild. So your people watching over you. It says they tried to clown you, but you've always been better than them. All right? Somebody trying to talk shit about you, talk down on you. But they want to be like you and steal your style. Y'all still got the card. It says, apology not fucking accepted. I don't blame you. It says, what makes you you, they could never be. They can't be you, Scorpio. It keeps popping out. Y'all still got the card. It says, your success makes others feel like they're not doing enough. All right? So they're trying to take your shit or destroy your shit. Y'all still got the card. It says, all his hoes is watching you. So these females that he was fucking with, because remember you had the card talking about, I don't love them hoes. All right, they all watching you because you the motherfucking empress. You hold the crown. You also got the card that said they blocked you to make people think they're not watching you, but they still are. So you being stopped by these little karmics and shit. And it says they judge you before they even got to know you. All right. And it says, I know you be talking to cards and crystals about me. So some of y'all are definitely tarot readers, okay? <laughs> all right. It says they are being threatened to not talk to you. And it says, I saw her, but she didn't say anything to me. So somebody could be saying this shit or saying they saw you or something. I don't know. But it says, somebody's trying to create fake beef with you for some clout, all right? Because they feel like you got shine and shit. So now they're trying to create fake beef with you. And it says, very mature for their age. So you're very mature. And it says, the playboy fell in love. So this person was dealing with a lot of people, but then they fell in love with you. And it says, gas station. Somebody could have seen somebody at the gas station. Somebody could work at the gas station. Something could be going down at the gas station. I'm going to treat you like royalty, all right? Work from home. Somebody could do that, okay? And it says, they're trying to figure out why he loves you so much. They mad as hell about this shit. Let's get a few more calls from my Scorpios, y'all. 
All right, as soon as I open up the deck, what we seeing, they see you as a prize, most definitely, Empress. Also, I'm seeing other influencers are wanting to work with you. So, people want to network with you in some type of way, okay? You got some type of attention, some type of star status, some type of uh, creative, beautiful work in some type of way, okay? I feel like you're not telling me something, which means they're definitely not telling you something. Somebody hiding secrets. Look, somebody's trying to create blockage for, blockages for you on purpose. They see you rising. They see you getting the attention. They see your person love you. They're trying to block it. A Sagittarius could be involved in this situation. You book smart, very intelligent. They can't fuck with you. Coming over to play the game, somebody could be doing it, or they just want to come over and be in your energy. Divine feminine to divine masculine. This pain is unbearable. I feel like giving up, but I'm trying to hold on. Somebody wants to let you in on something because somebody hide and see you. They're doing some shady shit behind your back, and somebody want to come tell you about what the hell going on. Also, it says a hairstylist who was messy and full of drama. So keep these hairstylists out your business, all right? Because somebody been messy. Let's get a few more cards. Okay. It says, I can't wait to see you again. Somebody got finesse out of something. Understanding you was important to me. They're trying to understand you because they love you. And it says, this situation is going to show you who's real and who's fake. Somebody fake as fuck. Uh, somebody got put out. It says, yay, celebrities are watching you and want to work with you, okay? And it says, quit it. Oh, we did see sponsors and endorsements and other influencers wanting to work with you. Hell yeah. Um, we also got the card that says, quitting is expensive. So somebody want to quit something. This could be a job, a relationship, something. But they can't quit, all right, because it'll be too expensive. And it says, they act like you don't influence them, but you do. They won't even give your motherfucking credit around here. All right? <laughs> Let's see. I'm seeing they should have wore protection, so either somebody got pregnant or somebody got an STD, one way or the other. We got turned the fuck off by someone. Okay, somebody getting... All right, so somebody getting exposed for trying to make you look bad, right? And they told people not to work with you, but people know you the best at what the fuck you do. They know that this person lying on you, okay? I don't know what to do. Now somebody's confused. They don't know what to do. They feel like they're in the middle of some shit. Let me see. Yeah, somebody. For some of y'all, this was your friend that did this. But, you know, sometimes we see our friends as family or our family as friends. But if somebody close to you did this, period. I can treat you better than my friend did, Okay? Yeah, so it looked like your friend was a big fan of the shit that you do, and they started copying off you and trying to take your man's shit. The karmic is a big fan of divine feminine. Work uh, works hard so they don't have to be to deal with their emotion. So somebody could be working hard so they won't have to feel some type of pain. And it says he is used to women chasing after him. Yeah, because he was a bit of a playboy. So he had a lot of people wanting him too, but he fell in love with you, okay? At the bottom of the deck again, they should have wore protection. Somebody, at least somebody got pregnant because we did see the empress at the beginning of the reading, right? Right? Yeah, we did. Yeah. And last card, they have no reason not to like you. They just see you as a three. And somebody's very unhappy in the environment I mean, they're in. So please like this video, video if it resonated at all. Thank y'all so much. I love y'all.